All right, hands on challenge time. Set checkpoints to find errors in your code. So basically, we are going to set checkpoints on the sample code the trailhead gave us. And that's pretty much it. Okay, let's launch the playground. And I am going to launch our developer console here. Developer console. I'm going to close this and close that and flip back. So we want to open email mission specialist Apex class. Let's open that first file. Open Apex class and email mission specialist. All right. We have that. Now line 12, we want to make sure it's this one, messaging send email result. Let's see, yeah, that's the one. So that's good. So set a checkpoint on line 12. We can flip back here, click here to set a checkpoint, boom. Okay. Use execute anonymous to execute the email specialist Apex class using your email address. So control E or command E if you're on a Mac, this is that and I'm going to execute. Boom. So that's executed. Observe the checkpoint results and see the values of the objects in memory. Well, they don't, they're not going to track us for that. But let's go to checkpoints here. And I want to scroll this up a bit here and email mission specialists. Um, there. Okay, so we have symbols, we have the heap here. And this is the class there. We can see what's going on. So it's working. And the symbols, you can see there. The value is student at zone.io, mail, there's a bunch of stuff. So let's pretend we are a hacker and we are reviewing every single value in the memory and stuff. I honestly don't use this too much when developing because we haven't come to this, this point to, you know, develop a super precise and super um, accurate and to the grain level like this, you want to know every um, memory address and stuff like that. So, well, rarely use this, but it's very powerful if you really, really need to use this. So I think that's it. That's our challenge. And we're just going to get the, the points. And I'll see you on the last section for developer console basics, which is execute SOCL and social queries, which is pretty straightforward. So I'll see you in the next video. Bada bing and bada boom. Hit that subscribe button and explore new trailhead grounds and learn to implement the most useful and popular apps on the Salesforce app exchange. And do yourself a favor, like this video and you'll be surprised on how much more you understand when watching this same video after liking it. Don't take my word, watch this one more time after you like the video and see it for yourself. Bada bing, bada boom.